Hi, uh, in this video I'm going to talk about uh, uh, Levenberg algorithm for uh, solving nonlinear least square problem. Uh, so what we had earlier was a gradient descent, which uh, you start from a point and the next point going to be uh, lambda, which is a step size u set and a gradient of the function. But if you don't know why the gradient of the function shows the best direction to uh, minimize your uh, objective function have a look on my other video where i explain that wh where why do we get this and uh, we have nefm method uh or gauss nefm method for optimization where we have this and if you don't know again how do we get this uh, have a look on my other video uh gauss nefm for optimization but uh, uh if you want to recap it it's a uh, approximate function by second order uh, uh function and then uh Basically, writing a Taylor student for second order and then uh, set, set it to zero and finding a root of that. And uh, that's how we get this. Uh, if your data has more than one dimension, uh, if your xn is uh, from Rn space, and this is this going to be Haitian, it's going to be Jacobian. So we have this and we have uh, Levenberg. So uh, the Levenberg, uh, if, if you have a look here, we have h plus lambda i, so it's like a uh, uh, Newton method, but here we have h plus lambda i here instead of h. This is for multi dimensional data, this is h for higher order. Uh, we have h here, so if lambda goes to infinity, uh, uh, h will lose uh, its importance. So it's we're gonna have uh, i, so this is gonna be uh, identity matrix and the inverse is itself. So it became a uh, gradient descent. If lambda goes to zero. So we have H, so it became a Newton method. So as you can see, it uh, it's, it's, uh, uh, has a flavor from both uh, algorithm, and uh, uh, it acts like a gradient descent when the parameters are far away from the optimal point, and it acts like more uh, like a, a gauss Newton method when the parameters are uh, close to optimal value. So that's why it's a very popular uh, approach. Okay, thank you for your attention.